Well, some hours later, and around 43,000 lines, we can see uh, what has been done to the park. Extensive uh, work on it. We have uh, over half of the impeller finished. Well, not finished, but uh, roughed. And we will be uh, finishing this part uh, tonight. The, the remaining of it, so still about six hours to, to finish. And then we will start with uh, finishing of the hub and then uh, finishing of the blades and at the very end finishing of the radius of the blades and hub. And that's it. Uh, we will have to, once we start, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, once we finish uh, uh, roughing, we need to recheck for the center in order to be more, more precise because the part does move a little bit. Uh, you know, very few um, ten thousands of an inch moves off uh, the the center. Natural of the roughing, and uh, prior to doing the finishing, we will uh, check for that uh, in order to to make a better part. I'll keep you up to date. Machine just finished machining. We wanna go and see what uh, the tool did. part looks fair, fair enough. Let us clean it a little bit and start checking again to continue with the finishing of it. That's a, a fairly good roughing of it. The part looks, looks very nice for a roughing. I said we will start doing some, some cleanup of the part to start to inspect it well. Uh, Again, we'll keep you posted. Good morning. We continue with the finishing of the blade. And we're, we're right now finishing the sides of the blade and the bottom of the flat part of the blade. This tool already has the radius needed and the finish it leaves is very good. Very soft. The machine just finished the program. We are going to check it. We may have to rerun the program at higher RPM in order to improve the finish. We will clean the part and then inspect it with a manual micrometer to see the thickness of the blades and the bottom of it, the height of the, of the turbine, to see if the planes are well. But we want to rerun first the, the same program in order to uh, increase the speed and, in, and improve the surface finish. Out of boy.
That thing is now spinning fast. It doesn't even make a noise. If the surface finish is not up to what we want, we may have to change the inserts and remeasure the tool in order to use new inserts and rerun this program. It's a very short program, but I think we can manage. The, the inserts were very good in, in, in very good shape yet, shape yet. We have started doing the hop finishing with a half an inch a ball mill. We are trying to soften that surface over there. Let's see if we can zoom in off. So you can appreciate. You can see right now how it's smoothing the surface. It's also a complex five axis machining. And it's going to take a long time. but we've checked and he's doing it very good. So, let's leave it running in here for about uh, six or seven hours and uh, we'll check how, how it accomplishes the, the task. We're about half the way. It's around four o'clock. We are half the way. We expect to finish around six or seven, and uh, the finish is quite good. You can see the difference there is not finished, and this one is already finished. I appreciate it. also there how the finish is, and that's not finished. Um, the whole parts quite good. Uh, right there, we're gonna have to work a little bit more. Uh, the, the lower radiuses and an additional finish on the on the um, blades. Right there, there is a very small around. Uh, six or seven thousandths of an inch um, step. We'll work that out. And uh, the part looks fairly well. And still working on it.